go? Yeah. Okay. So before we start, I just want to show you one quick thing. It's pretty cool what we've been working on. Okay. It's an engineering display. Yeah. But uh, this just tells me what we're doing in the car. So you can see as I turn the wheel, you see the front steer here? You see the rear steer opposite direction, right? You also see I go into park, now into drive. And you'll see the torques here, as well as the brake command. Gotcha. So if you, I don't you know, kind of see what's going I on. I usually show people in the back, but it might get you a little car sick if you look at that. But if you'd like, you can. Feel okay. Free. So how, uh, what speed does the rear steer switch? Um, it's calibratable, so I don't think I want to tell you necessarily the speed that it switches, but uh, I can make it whatever you'd like. We're doing the, the perfect optimization for both the safety of the car as well as the performance. Okay. And it's not only the speed, so a lot of other um, rear steer systems actually go by, based on speed. We can actually do it adaptively. So even if at low speed and you're out of phase and you have that agile performance, if the car becomes unstable for any reason, we can switch to in phase to help stabilize the car. Gotcha. Okay. Ad automatic, actively. Okay. So we're going to show you a th few things here. This is our beta car. It's uh, not as aesthetically pleasing as our show car, but it's perfect functionality for me. They share the same platform. Okay. So, guys, so we're going to start with some nice, easy, smooth sweepers. The car is long, 3.2 meters wheelbase, like you saw in the back. However, it's still agile and smooth and graceful. So we're ready to do some, uh, some more dynamic stuff? Sure. Just hold on. Alright, here we go. It really turns in fast, like a sports car. Okay, so that was uh, out of phase. Now we're going to show you uh, the safety, but I need you to do me a favor. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go straight towards the barrier, okay. and you're going to tell me when to turn. You're going to say now. Uh, okay. Alright, you ready? Okay. Okay. Don't forget, please. Sure. Uh, now. Not bad, right? No bad. So the reason why I want to show you that is because it allows us to be a very high dynamic performance car. But try that in a Porsche or a Ferrari, right? You'd spin out, right? So we have the best of both worlds where we can be stable as well Okay. for our passengers. All right, ready for the big event? Sure. Okay, this is going to be a launch. And we're going to, uh, you ready? Put yeah. Head all the way back. Do you have a specific mode or is it always at full power? Uh, it's always at full power, but um, I also have a, uh, a launch mode, but we're not uh, going to show that just yet. But okay. this is pretty close. So okay. You ready for it? Yep. Okay, here we go. Yeah, that's really quick. Not bad, right? What do you think? Yeah, it's impressive. It's like being on one of those linear induction roller coasters. I know, right? Yeah, yeah. How many yeah. times can you do that in a row before you overheat something? I can tell you, that's what actually, people are actually picking up on that. We've been doing this every 15 minutes the entire day. So we can go back and do it right now. And I've been what was the speed rides. you're getting up to? And doing um, that 60 miles an hour. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So it was a zero to 60. How'd you like it? It's great. <laughs> Not bad, right? Yeah. Well, I'm glad that you came out to visit us. Thank you. Uh, thank, thank you, you for, for coming us. to see what we're doing. Absolutely. And uh, yeah, hope to see you soon. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much.